it's time for hand sanitizers and little Clorox. Ryan's Weekly Thoughts. Ryan's Weekly Thoughts. Give me my back. Give me my finger back. Give me my finger back. Give me my finger back. Ah. Ow. Ooh. Hi. <laughs> I'm Ryan McChesney, and this is Ryan's Weekly Thoughts, and, and we've got a great show for you today. Uh, I'm joined by my good friends, Danny and Sarah. Danny and Sarah, how are you all doing today? Well, not too good, Mr. Ryan. What? What's going on? Uh, well, you, you see, we, um, we, uh, we got grounded this week, Mr. Ryan. He, you're grounded? What for? Um, well, Mom and Dad gave us chores to do. Like, I was supposed to take out the trash, and I was supposed to clean up the dishes, and we didn't do any of it. Ah. Uh, you know, the Bible tells us that, that we are to obey our parents. It says in Colossians 3.20, Obey your Mom and Dad, for this pleases the Lord. Or, as my translation goes, Obey your Mom and Dad, and God will be really glad. So, you know, it might not make sense right now, but it's, it's important to obey your mom and dad because one, it's a godly thing to do, and two, they're your parents and they essentially know what's best for you, okay? We understand, Mr. Ryan. We don't want to get grounded again. Look, I, I didn't like doing chores either as a child, but I, I understand it now as an adult, and I understand the importance of obeying your parents now, you know, looking back on things. So, trust me, I know it's not easy. Oh, please. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> the irony. Hey, Mr. Ryan's dad! Ladies and gentlemen, my dad. He's still here. He's never leaving. It's great. Oh, listen, kids. You'd have better luck wrestling a bear in the woods than getting this person to do anything that you told him to do when he was a kid. Ain't that right? Yeah, I did. <laughs> but he is correct right now in that you do have to listen to what your parents tell you. All right? And you, son, by the looks of it, need to clean up your place. Now, I've been in your room, and your room's a giant mess, so... And I've done told you to clean that up once! Okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll get to... I'll clean my room later, Dad. Go clean your room, son. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll clean it later. Uh-huh. So what did I just tell you? Yeah, well, it's my place, Dad. Yep. What did I just tell you? Dad, I said I'll clean What did later. I just tell you? No, don't smoke back. Dad? Don't talk back to me. I'll clean don't it. talk back to me. I'll, I'll clean it later, Dad. Don't talk back no, to Dad, me. No, Dad, what's... what's no. Why can't I just clean it later? One. Dad? Two. Dad, I'll clean it later, okay? Two and a half. No, Dad? Three. That's it, you're grounded. Just... You can't ground me, Dad. This isn't fair. No Take your car keys, no car for a week. Give me my car keys! Give me my car! This is so unfair right now! <laughs> keep talking back to me and it's gonna be another week. Now go clean your room. No! No! Give me my car keys! Give me my car keys! <laughs> Kids these days think they can get away with anything. Go clean your room, son. Dad! This is not fair! It's not fair! Well, we'll keep talking back and see how long we can go, because I can do this for a while. I'm not going anywhere, and neither are you. <laughs> okay. It's not fair! Remember to obey your parents, kids. Bye.